Some are calling them radical ideas by the Catholic Church to fix the global economic crisis. Our own Lisa Sylvester reports. Occupy Wall Street protesters carried a golden calf named Greed to make their point. The growing gap between the rich and the poor. My biggest beef is uh, the growing economic disparity. Uh, I have a problem that I feel we have a capitalist system that is based around hoarding wealth instead of dispersing it to grow capital and help the free market grow. The division between the haves and the have-nots is a message long central to the Catholic Church. Now the Vatican is picking up on the momentum and speaking out against what it calls the idolatry of the market. For the first time, the Vatican has outlined what it sees as a moral fix for the problem of poverty, a proposal to create a new financial authority, including a global central bank and a new tax on global financial transactions. Globalization has made us all uh, in, in the same boat, and we're going to either sink together or, or we're going to prosper together. But we're only going to do that if we work together as a world community to deal with these issues. The Vatican says the International Monetary Fund has lost the ability to stabilize the world financial system and points to the current debt crisis in Europe and the lingering effects of a global recession. But added regulation and centralizing global authority, Mark Calabria with the Cato Institute counters, will exacerbate the problems and put more power in the hands of a wealthy few. The attitude that you are sort of insulating this further from public accountability in the individual countries actually increases the leverage that the largest financial institutions have in this game because they'll be the ones at the table. Father Thomas Reese says this is meant to be a moral blueprint, a first draft to be tweaked by economists and politicians. Like the Occupy Wall Street protesters, the Vatican hopes to draw attention to the issue of poverty and offer a vision where principles trump profits. Now, Father Reese with Georgetown's Woodstock Theological Center acknowledges these uh, proposals are to the very far left. In fact, the Pope advocates redistribution of wealth, and uh, that's all going to be a really tough sell. But the Vatican believes it is still important to have a conversation about what it calls a crisis in morality, Wolf. Father Reese is with Georgetown University. Okay, thanks very much for that, Lisa. So will President Obama's foreign policy successes help him in 2012?